Roxy, switching over to a story that is new this morning. This month, we are honoring all of our military branches as part of National Military Appreciation Month. KTSM 9 News reporter Jasmine Perry tells us how the borderland can unite with our soldiers at Fort Bliss. Jasmine, good morning. Good morning, Brenda and Trevor. I spoke to an event coordinator who is also a military spouse on how civilians can honor our heroes this weekend. As a military spouse, I brought something different to the table because I was not only an employee, but I was also a patron of MWR events and programs. It's Military Appreciation Month and Marketing Special Events Manager Michelle Wiernicki is a military spouse at Fort Bliss. Although she and her husband have been married for 26 years, she can relate with the Fort Bliss community. With three children born in the military, she knows what it's like to have her husband deployed more than once. So it's been a great experience for me. Um, my spouse was deployed several times while we were in the Army. Uh, we loved El Paso so much that we decided to call this our home. Wiernicki has been working with MWR for about 11 years now and is so grateful for all the events Fort Bliss has to offer. When he was deployed, I think, it, I think what's one of the, the good parts about that is that you build really strong friendships with people who are in the same boat as you, um, especially others that have children and you kind of rely on each other. So there's some, you know, there's something to be said for the sisterhood that is created um, when you have a, a deployed spouse. During the month of military appreciation, Fort Bliss will have its annual Armed Forces Day Parade to honor all branches of the service. Wernicke tells KTSM they will provide Army displays for military and non-military families to take pictures on, as well as inflatable attractions, food trucks, sponsors, and non-profit resources. Bring the kids, have a great time, it doesn't cost you anything, and it gets you out into the community and see all the cool stuff Fort Bliss has to offer. The Armed Forces Parade will be from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. this Saturday. And Michelle says for your recreational pass, do not wait till mon Saturday morning to get it since lines will be long. And remember to bring a real ID or a state federal passport. Reporting live from Fort Bliss, I'm Jasmine Perry, KTSM 9 News.